Alright guys, this is a review on the Rubik's slide. Um, so, you turn it on by the back here. Hold on. Yeah, right there. And you can do like a time attack or um, just an infinite amount of time. You just... So I'll, uh, I'll do easy for you. And then... I don't know if you can see it very well. Yeah, it's too hard to see, but there's a a check button or like a like a a check mark, and you do that to uh tell where it needs to go. But first, you hit the little arrow to pick what difficulty. So you press the checker, and it needs to go there. So I don't press the checker, and I need to get it there. So I move it over. And then it'll do this, so checker needs to be a center, so all I need to do is move it down. Two of them, so all I need to do is like pretty much just so I need to get both those two a center and a corner. So now that it's a center and a corner, I can bring it down. That easy. So if you like this little review and think you might like the puzzle, um, I think you can get it at Walmart. Um, and they are selling it uh, at Rubik.com for I think four dollars more, and you get a free Rubik's bag. I did not do that because I just didn't feel like it. Because I'm about to buy the V Cube five, six, and seven because you know. This black, this five, uh, cube smith, um, is not very good. It's like, I, I don't know if you guys can tell, but it's really loose, like, it's really loose, so I'm gonna get a new one.